Hi everyone. So in this section, I'm going to cover some question answers raised by you guys. So the first question is, is admin server mandatory in a weblogic domain? So if you have not yet gone through the weblogic domain concepts, I suggest you go and have a look at weblogic domain concept first. And if you still have this doubt, is admin server mandatory in domain? Then the answer is yes. An admin server is mandatory in domain. So if you quickly have a look at what we covered in domain, a domain is a combination of an admin server and managed server and clusters. So in admin server, there is one and always one admin server. There could be zero or more managed servers, zero or more clusters, but always one and only one admin server. So you can't create a domain without an admin server. An admin server can't span across domains. So you can't have one admin server managing multiple weblogic domains or multiple or one weblogic domain having multiple admin servers. You can only have one admin server. And similarly, you can't have a domain without an admin server. So this answers the question whether is admin server mandatory in a domain? So answer is yes. Thank you.